Butte's Our Lady of the Rockies group is eager to one day build an aerial tram to the statue on the East Ridge. MTN's John Amy tells us there's still one major hurdle to cross, the interstate, before this project ever moves forward. Butte's Our Lady of the Rockies group has the land and the plans to build an aerial tram to Butte's famous statue. However, if it can't get permission from the U.S. Highway Department, there's no way the tram will ever get off the ground. The only alternative is going over the interstate with the tram. Because of this, the Our Lady group, along with help from the Montana Department of Transportation, must convince the U.S. Highway Department that a tram crossing 50 feet above this portion of North Interstate 15 will not be a distraction to traffic or a safety hazard. The Federal Highways feels that there could be a possibility of, of riders throwing stuff out of the tram itself and, and they've, uh, the design has taken that into consideration to where it's, you know, it's an enclosed area, they, they won't be able to throw that out. Um, they were worried about at nighttime if there's lights that uh, are on the tram that cause uh, distractions to drivers that there might be crashes. Only a few cities in the U.S. have trams that cross interstate highways, like the one in Portland, Oregon. Tram supporters in Butte will have a meeting this week to discuss developing a report for the highway department outlining all the tram safety precautions. And what they need to do is, is kind of button that all up into a, a package that Federal Highways and the, and the Department of Transportation can review and make that final uh, call as to whether or not we can allow it or not. The U.S. Highway Department would be more likely to approve this project if the Our Lady Group can show that a tram would bring an added benefit to the community. And that benefit? Better access to hiking and biking trails on the East Ridge. This would give that opportunity to access that trail that otherwise uh, would not be able to be utilized because of the of how you get, have to get up there on a private road. And it's still a long road to cross before this project can take flight. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News. Thanks, John.